and they're off in the New York, presented by Rivers Casino. Didia is very quick, so is Fev Rover. And on the far outside, here's Royalty Interest up to take the lead. Surprisingly, is up close in the early going, too, as Sparkle Blue moves up to take fourth. Didia, who broke well, is now sitting about five lengths off the lead. Then comes English Rose, who is right next to Be Your Best as they move into the first turn. Aspen Grove between rivals. McCulloch is down at the rail. And Star Fortress just outside of that pair, a dozen lengths off the pacemakers. Then comes Nisi Marie, racing on the inside of Warlike Goddess. And it's another two back to American Sonia, who trails. 23 seconds flat for the opening quarter, set by Royalty Interest, who takes them on to the Saratoga backstretch, leading by a length and a half. Surprisingly, is a clear-cut second. It's another three back to Fev Rover. The half went in 47 and three-fifths seconds. Didia is on the inside, just four lengths off the pace, moving up just a bit. McCulloch follows her. Sparkle Blue is outside of that rival as they come to the half-mile pole. English Rose kept in the clear in the blue and is now passing rivals. There goes English Rose within five lengths of the pace. They are followed by Be Your Best, who's toward the back of the field, along with the gray star fortress who's trying to make some headway. Aspen Grove on the inside in 111 and four, and American Sonia, who was last, is now moving up four wide. They're coming to the quarter pole, royalty interest, confronted by surprisingly, as they reach the top of the stretch, surprisingly is up to take the lead. Didia is running a huge race in the center of the course, and she runs by surprisingly, full of run. Following her is Nisi Marie on the outside, and then comes McCulloch, but it is Didia in a tremendous performance to win the New York presented by Rivers Casino. Nisi Marie was second. Warlike Goddess rallied into third. 